shake that body. Hello, welcome back to IDSR Pro with me, Mike Smith. Today, I thought I would show you another UAD plugin, the Manly Massive Passive EQ. What I've done is just got a load of drums and put them to a, a drum group, and I've put the Manly Massive Passive across the whole drums, just so we can hear exactly what it's doing to the sound. So, let's uh, have a listen. Basically, there's a drum loop as it is. turn the massive passive on and what I'm going to do is go through every single preset So there you go, those are all the presets that come with the UAD plugin. Now, I think what we'll do is just flicking through them, the deep and crunchy for me sort of stood out a little bit. It is in excess with the bottom end, um, it's boosting it sort of a little bit too much, but for me, it just rounded all the bottom end off and made the drum loop sound pretty nice. So that's it with it on, that's it bypassed. I thought that'd be a good starting point for us to just have a, a look through the Manly Massive Passive. So, first of all, at the top of each section, you've got a boost, a out, and a cut switch, which is as it suggests. Obviously, in that position, it'll boost. That means there's no processing, and cut means it cuts. So, you've also got a shelf and a bell toggle switch, which uh, with regards to the to frequency here you could see you could have a low shelf or a bell and uh, adjust the cue so let's boost the bottom end let's roll it off first bring it back in to taste we'll go to excess And of course at the bottom here you can select your frequency now it goes from 22 hertz right up to one kilohertz that was set at 220 i believe so let's just have a little mess And then the same applies to each individual section. So this next one, I believe, starts at 82 hertz up to 3,900 3, 3, kilohertz. Again, same boost, out, and cut. This one's set to boost. It's on a bell. Uh, it's set at a frequency of 82, I believe that is. With a little bit of gain. Well, let's let's boost it again I'm just you know twiddling the parameters really I'm, I'm not doing anything specific just so you can hear what it's actually doing uh, our next band has got a cut at 10k and again it's set to bell and it's quite wide and it's got a massive amount of cut on it so let's, let's wind that back off so you can 
hear what it's doing. It's, it's band is at a boost this runs from 560 Hertz up to 27 kilohertz it's set at 500 again it's on a shelf and there is a bit of gain and it's a quite a wide shelf So there you go, just a, a, a quick little look. Uh, this middle section here, obviously you've got your power and you've got a link. Now that link basically means that when the link is on, like it is in, in our case, this left hand side basically controls the right hand side as well. So if link was off, I could adjust this and it would be separate to the left hand side. So. You can see there now that it's on if I move one it links them both you've also got a low pass and a high pass filter these are both set to off currently so let's turn them on so you can hear them So there you go, I mean that roughly is it. Uh, as far as EQs go, um, I've not used the manually massive passive enough myself yet to uh, really understand the concepts but apparently it does work in its own unique way which makes the manually massive passive kind of a, a sought after EQ. So very different to a lot of other EQs out there. So I will spend a little bit more time and I suggest if you want to learn more about the EQ itself you can actually go to their website and there's a full detailed manual there on the EQ and the spec of it itself. But I just thought this tutorial would let you listen to the the sounds. I think what we'll do is just quickly maybe go through another, another preset now uh, like a drum bus and, and just mess around again just so you can hear what it's doing. So. Let's go to full drum kit. Now that for me sounds a bit flat straight away, so. That's probably because the real highs are being cut. So let's put that into boost. And in fact, let's turn each band off for now. And we'll go through one at a time, so. set to shelf we'll leave it on shelf and um, we'll increase let's put that to about eight super high isn't it so let's bring that down a bit Quite a broad band, a little bit of boost. Actually, let's take that one back out, let's put that to a bell.
más. So there you go, just a quick overview really of the Manly Massive Passive. Again, uh, not really spent any time there going into detail with anything, it's just a case of letting you have a listen to the sound and to be able to compare it to other EQs, whether it's from Waves or other third party companies. But the uh, UAD, Manly Massive Passive, okay, till next time, bye bye. Check that body. Get, get, get down.